Hello, 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 Soria here. Today is New Year's Eve, so 2022 is practically over. And every couple of months I reconsider my language study plan. So when the new year is about to start, I write down my goals and plans. And although it doesn't always work out, I think I make the best out of it by having some vision of where to go to in the future. It's always fun to look back at the goals we set the year before and observe if we accomplished them, if they changed or if we can look up for new strategies for studying languages. So, for 2023, I'm gonna focus on French, Russian, Japanese, Romanian, and Turkish. So, for French, I want to reach level B2, and I want to be ready to apply to the exam DELF B2, and I want to focus mainly on speaking. Also, I would like to read five French novels minimum and be able to watch a movie or three movies without subtitles. Then for Russian, I also want to focus on speaking and writing and that comes along with pronunciation, vocabulary and grammar. Also, I would like to read just one Russian novel and be able to watch different TV shows. Then for Japanese, um, I have to mention that I studied Japanese for three years, a long time ago, and recently I started studying again. I think it was last year when I started studying again uh, with the Mina no Nihongo. So, I finished the second book, but I'm not sure which level I am at right now. So, my goal is to reach level N3 for the GLPT. And to do so, I bought myself a workbook. I have some other resources to study, and I think I will do a video in the future to share them with you. For Romanian, I studied Romanian for about six months, if my memory serves me right, and I want to resume it. It was pretty fun for me, but I couldn't find a lot of resources to study it by myself, but my native language is Spanish, so it wasn't really hard, I think, so my goal is to reach level B1. And finally, Turkish. I just want to start learning Turkish and see how it goes. <laughs> I watched, I didn't finish it, but I started watching a, like a, I don't know, a drama uh, called, how was it called? Ashk, Kiraluk Ashk. And I started uh, learning, if you can say it's learning, um, because I didn't really commit to it, um, but started learning Turkish with Duolingo. But this year I really want to uh, put an effort and just have fun. So finally I just want to say stick with what works with you. If you know you improve your language skills by taking private lessons, then do so if you have the opportunity. But it also helps if you push yourself out of your comfort zone a little bit. I want to know your language goals, so leave a comment down below. I hope you enjoyed the video and I wish you all a great start of the year. Bye, 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 bye.